10 hard drive in your GL10. So, first thing what you have to do is remove all screws, one, two, three, four screws, and take them out. To start with, we will first remove the right side panel, take it out, and put a SATA connector in. Put a SATA Good. connector. So I've already laid out a SATA connector. So this SATA connector goes in one of these four ports. And what you have to do is basically take the SATA connector and put it in any of the ports. So this is done. Once you connect the SATA connector and you put the wire back in to the back end side of the machine. Now let's move to the back side. So in the back side, you have your SATA connector which just, we just put in. This is your SATA connector and you have multiple cables for your power connectors for your SATA hard drive. So we're taking a SATA hard drive and all you have to do is uh, connect the SATA ports. SATA ports are done. Connect anything in power. So align the key and this goes into power like this. Done. And lower it down into the chamber you'll see there are four standoffs one two three four standoffs with rubber grommets and there are four holes at the back of the machine so there are four holes at the back of the machine where it will be connecting and in the box in the box you get these four screws which goes in the hard drive so we've already taken out the screws and these are the screws which go into the hard drive Now, all you have to do is put one screw in and first of all, you need to put the hard drive in place like this and in the bottom, you should see that the threads are matching the holes at the bottom. Once, you, once they are matching, you just screw them in. Once this is done, just pack the system back again. Put in the four security screws and you're good to go. This is your hardware upgrade on the Chill 10. So this is a RAM upgrade for GL10. So upgrading the RAM is very simple. All you have to do is take out the screws on the right hand side and uh, take out the cover. Once you take out the cover, you'll see that there is one RAM already inserted inside the RAM slot. But if you want to upgrade, you can just simply uh, take out this RAM and uh, put your the RAM of your choice. So we're taking some uh, aftermarket RAM. These are some rip jaws 4. And you can put them in where uh, removing the, that RAM. So all you have to do is, so this side of this, uh, there are two pins for a RAM slot. There are two pins for the RAM slot and this pin does not open. So only this pin opens. You just pop it out and take the RAM disk, RAM disk out like this. This will come out. And now you have to put your RAMs. So you align the key with the key in the motherboard. Put the back side first in very carefully because you don't want to harm the motherboard either. And you'll hear click noise. And that means that the RAM has uh, got its place. So one and Click noise. You will see that the other locks have been already locked into place, so they are unlocked and now locked. So these are your RAM upgrades for the GLJ.